Today, I ask you to renounce sin and to profess your faith in Christ. And so I ask you, do you reject sin so as to live in the freedom of God's children? Do you reject the glamour of evil and refuse to be mastered by sin? Do you reject Satan, the father of sin and prince of darkness? Do you believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth? Do you believe in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was born of the Virgin Mary, was crucified, died, and was buried, rose from the dead, and is now seated at the right hand of the Father? Do you believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting? Since you have rejected sin and professed your faith in Jesus Christ, I invite you to lean over the clock and receive baptism. Catherine, I baptize you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Catherine, you have now become a new creation and have clothed yourself in Christ. You simply like Christ. Catherine, you have been enlightened by Christ. Strive to walk always as a child of the light and keep the flame of faith alive in your heart. When the Lord comes, may you go out to meet him with all the saints in the heavenly kingdom. And now, Catherine, by your baptism you have been born again in Christ, and you have become a member of Christ and of his priestly people. Now you are to share in the outpouring of the Holy Spirit among us, the Spirit sent by the Lord upon his apostles at Pentecost, and given by them and their successors to the baptized. The promised strength of the Holy Spirit, which you are to receive, will make you more like Christ and help you to be his witness, help you to be a witness to his suffering, death, and resurrection. It will strengthen you to be an active member of the church and to build up the body of Christ in faith and in love. Dear friends, let us now pray to God our Father that he will pour out the Holy Spirit upon Catherine to strengthen her with his gifts and anoint her to be more like Christ. The Son of God. All powerful God, Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, by water and the Holy Spirit, you freed your sons and daughters from sin and gave them new life. Send your Holy Spirit upon them to be their helper and guide. Give them the spirit of wisdom and understanding, the spirit of right judgment and courage, the spirit of knowledge and reverence. Fill them with the spirit of wonder and awe in your presence. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Catherine, be sealed with the gift of the Holy Spirit. Peace be with you. 